Now, this yeah. is also another DAC amp. This has been, you know, CES approved, uh, awarded in 2019. And I believe that's about when I got it. So I've been using this constantly. You guys will see that it's actually can be used with PS4. It can be used with Xbox. Now, back to the sound card. This is a sound amp that, like I said, use PS4, Xbox, PC. I use it on PC. I save the box on purpose. Back here shows you how it looks, how it works, how you connect up your mics to inside, outside, stuff like that. We're going to pop this open and show you guys this packaging. They always are proud of their product. You know, very tight, tightly packed, very nice product. Now, with this product, if you guys can see this, this logo, the Blaster X, that lights up. That will light up. It will change colors to how you want it light up. They actually have a software for this. I can't walk through the software for this one because it's actually uh, disconnected. Now, to contest to how much I've used this, if you look at the back, that's how much rubbing this thing has done on my desk. You guys can see that. Now, the, the pad is, has their logo on it too. On the back end, you have your 3.5 millimeter uh, jack line in, 3.5 out. They call these optical ins and outs. You know, to me, it's just a 3.5 millimeter jack. USB, you need the USB for your PC or for certain things like your consoles. Micro USB to USB, plug it in, then plug your 3.5 millimeter jack into your device, and it works. On the front, this is where you plug in your microphone and your headset. Uh, you know, unfortunately, if you have a single uh, plug, you have to use the dual adapter. They do give that to you in this kit. So you actually have the adapter to change that. <coughs> I apologize, guys. I haven't had anything to drink in hours. No, my um, throat's dry. My throat's dry, and yeah. I'm not even doing as much talking. So on the side, you have the same as the other one. You have scout mode. You have uh, SBX, which is the opposite uh, software than S SFX, FI. And then you have your gain low or medium or, you know, low or high. Does that. This tap, you tap it, it'll change some modes. It'll change the lighting for the modes you have set. You adjust it to the direction you want. The same thing, this will adjust your volume of the gain down. You tap it again, it'll adjust the volume of your chat up so you can hear the chat in the headset higher or lower than your game sound very cool option i love this i use this constantly before i got the new one this was a must have for me i mean i didn't know i needed it until i actually used it uh you know that's one of those things that you don't know you need it until it's like oh my god hey that really works well for gaming and streaming you know, if you're in Discord chat, chatting with your friends and you want to hear your footsteps of the enemy coming up behind you, this helps. It really does help adjust the sounds. Now, they have the software, like I said, you know, built-in software, which, you know, is very cool. They have the, you know, virtual 7.1, 32-bit surround, the 130 decibel usage, you know, with the built-in DAC amp, you know, the Dolby Digital, of course, decoding built-in all that good stuff that Sound Blaster does well. You know, just another one of them very, very, very cool products. This does work, like I said, for the Nintendo Switch, Xbox Ones, PS4s. I'm pretty sure you can use it on the PlayStation 5 and the newer Xbox 2. Um, I have not tested this out, but you will do it. So for the USB part, if you're using this for the console, this will be USB to a power. So like your wall plug or your console to power it. And then you just plug it in through the five point optical into the back of your Xbox or the PlayStation. You know, all pretty much the same. Same with, you know, the Nintendo Switch. You plug the 3.5 in, the power, power it up. PS4, same way, does the same thing. Optical power, then you get, you're on your go. You plug the headset in the front and you're good to go. Now the PC, PC is just the USB. So you just plug this one cord in. You don't need the opticals out because it'll just go in and your PC just runs it automatically and it's just perfect. The surround sound with this is great. The scout mode for, like I said, is it really works well to pinpoint and then with the software, you can actually test it to see if it's actually pinpointing to the directions you want it. Now, this is only gonna be as good 
as your headset. Now, the one thing I am going to talk about, this is a dual amp. So it has a left and right DAC amp built in. It's called the XA amp. Uh, it's a discrete headphone bi amp, which is pretty cool. Um, up to 600, uh, I believe, ohms, which is really weird. Now, this can be used on Mac OS, but on the Mac OS, you're going to lose the game voice mixer. You're going to lose the Sound Blaster command software. Um, placed for the Xbox, you're going to lose the game voice, the side, to the side mi mic monitoring, plus the command software. PlayStation 4, you only lose the direct mode which is really weird. PlayStation 5, you, use the, you lose the direct mode and the command software. Uh, Nintendo Switch, for the Switch, it's only good for mic monitoring, the SBX, and the scout mode. In this, you do get the optical cable, and now Justin was saying you don't have that. Now I'm gonna show you this. This is kinda cool. Now this optical cable is a trip. Now hopefully it's still sitting in here and I haven't used it. This optical cable that comes with this. Your optical cable with this one, if you see this, it's a long 3.5 millimeter jack. Hopefully you oh, guys see that. Optical, you know, I've never seen an optical 3.5 millimeter. Yeah, so it I has the it. optical, and then it goes into a normal optical, so you can plug that into you, like your PlayStation. Okay. So that's, so how, you, that's nice. how you do this. So this 3.5 goes into the this, and then it goes into that. So it's got a built-in optical way in, so it's not the same. 